Marco to cook him with Taha. Yeah! 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 Actually, we don't put the spaghetti in first, we put the salt in first. Do we? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what we did. Ah! I'm not eating it. Ah, four on crap! I'm not eating it. You're not eating it? <laughs> yeah, you're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. I'm not touching that, bro. Wait, you didn't even wash your hands? I did, I did. I had a shower, man. Balling? Balling? Now it's time to put the spaghetti in. Good form, good form. Yep! Yeah, buddy! Yeah, buddy! Yeah, buddy! Just Keep staying there, stay there. Go down. Don't do that with the cheese. Why? I don't, bro, you didn't even wash your hands. I did. Honestly, did I did. Bro, I had a shower, bro. So what? I washed my hands. You took everything when you did. What am I gonna do? This is how they do the chefs. Don't have way too much cheese. What is this? <laughs> Look at that, that's some of the good stuff, bro. <laughs> I think, guys, we're gonna taste test it now, but personally, I think that was a success. What do you think? Ikram thinks this is a success as well. So we're gonna taste test it now. Bro, that's pretty good, bro. No, it's actually decent. That's decent, though. No. Uh, the spaghetti could have been cooked a bit longer, maybe. What do you think? No, I think the, it's alright, you know. A bit more flavours, I think. Yeah, yeah, obviously, yeah, yeah. We literally only put salt in it. No, it's, it's fine, to be fair. Ooh, well done, buddy. Bro, huh? that's sick. That's decent, bro. I would eat this. How much would you pay for this in a restaurant? <laughs> I don't pay for it, what? <laughs> what? You said it's not that good. <laughs> hey bro, look how much there is. I actually made some for you in the... <laughs> you did, you did. I didn't, but how did you I just got done eating the spaghetti. Um, I just want to reflect about something. Recently, I watched a video by Ryan Ang, who's an amazing video creator. It was... It was basically about the history of vlogging. He talked about how it started off as something where people would just talk and show their lives and people subscribe to the YouTube channels if they liked or were interested in the person. Then it became this sort of competition where everyone was trying to show off, you know, oh, I've got like a $20 million house. Oh, look at my new cars. Yo, look at these Teslas that I'm giving to these random people. It basically became, you know, who could be the loudest. But then Ryan talked about the future of vlogging, how possibly it could adopt a more slower pace and showcase a more mundane life. And I thought that was really cool because it gives creators like me sort of hope. And it just reminded me to just sort of work on being genuine, being myself in front of the camera and working on my storytelling skills to hopefully display my life into these vlogs in an artistic and cool and easy to watch way. Anyway, wait there, toilet break. Toilet break! Who? A lot Cares. of people. Okay, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back! Okay, so my plan for today, I've already done some medicine work in the morning, I know. <coughs> Basically, I woke up for Fudger at 8, and I was like, yo, might as well get the work done now. So I did like, maybe two hours with like a break in between, so I've, that's it, no more medicine for the day. And then I cooked the food, you saw that, the, the spaghetti, it was sick, it was amazing. Yeah. I'm gonna go to the gym at 3 with Ikram, which is just in a few minutes. Yeah, then I'm gonna be learning some Urdu at 6.30 with a tutor. And then I've got football at nine. And then I might talk about some exciting purchases that I might make. I've ordered a new keyboard and I've ordered a new SSD. 
and I might be looking at getting a new monitor as well. So that's so exciting as well. Woo! That is it. Let's still make it exciting. Let's go team. Let's go. We just finished gym workout. I run out of bus to my headphones, uh, so I can listen to the gym music. The first thing that happened in the meeting room just couldn't stop that much. At the... <laughs> so on the bench press, yeah, I'm benching like quite heavy for me. I'm doing like five reps. <laughs> and as soon as he sits up, his bunda right in the, <laughs> right in the, it's like eye level, there's no escaping, and everything is exposed. Like, what? Okay, my old lesson is uh, 6 30, 10 minutes. Uh, I need to quickly clean this messy space, messy mind in it. So, gotta clean this in three, two, one. Okay, so that's as well as clean. Like, all of that, I can't, like, I've got too much stuff going on there, and but I mean, it's better, right? No. Uh, now, time for our Urdu lesson. So, let's get to it. Hello, Aslan, come Mohammed, bye. Waalaikum, Aslan, kaise hain? Main bilkul theek ho. Aap khair hain se? Subah, jaldi utha tha. Woke up early means jaldi utha tha. Jaldi utha ha. What? Wo beef burger is both dangerous. Hai. Kaise kehte? I've learned my lesson. Maine maine isse sabak sikha tha ke me ainda ainda beef burger nahi khaunga i ainda matlab kya hai ainda means next time oh okay ainda hanji it's 8:45 and uh do you know what that smells like Man like, uh, wait, 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 w